Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to take you guys into uh, the Audio Effects folder inside Logic Pro, and I'm going to show basically uh, beginners and new users to Logic Pro uh, um, more about plugins. Today's uh, highlight plugin is called the Rotor Cabinet. Uh, basically, what it does is it just puts it puts like an old, old, old style effect onto whatever whatever instrument or vocal it is you, that you want to do. I don't use this much, but uh, basically. Basically, you can change through your uh, your cabinets. We can go to real cabinet. It'll give you like a horn, a, a horn uh, knob, a, a drum knob. And you can switch between the horn or, or drum knob. Uh, you can uh, you can uh, accelerate the motor, make it go a little bit faster, make it go slower. It'll it'll change the effect of it and the max rate. You can you also have a knob for the max rate. Basically, what I want you guys to do is open this up. Uh, just leave it on real cabinet for right now. Uh, throw it on a, dr a drum track or a horn track and basically just just watch what it does to it It's not the craziest uh, plug-in But I kind of just want to give you guys a little overview on it. You know, hopefully you guys can get something good out of it uh, This is basically it the rotor cabinet. Oh, thank you guys for watching and please subscribe